Hi, I'm Susan Evans from SusanEvans.org and today we are going to make a fireworks art project. In Family Fun Magazine they said to tape a, um, a poster, a large uh, butcher paper to a shed or something outside and then use a little ball that has prongs all over to dip it in some paint and throw it against that shed. Well, thumbs down for that activity because what happened you can see clearly in the following clip. We are dipping a fluffy ball into some red paint and then we are going to splat it against some paper taped to the shed. Okay, our first try, ready, set, go. All right. <laughs> You see, packing tape isn't strong enough to hold it up and it will fall down. Another problem it had is that that ball would get into the dirt and get all nasty and so you had to wash it off every single time. You can put like wax paper under it or um, newspaper under it and that's what we were doing. The other problem with that is that kids when they are throwing will not hit the target and so you have butcher paper with nothing on it and kids throwing every which way. Take a look. And now I have modified this art project to actually work. First, fireworks happen at night, don't they? So I chose a black poster board instead of white. Next, I put it on the ground, okay? And then standing on a bench above it, you could drop it onto the poster. Then you have the beautiful splats and you have no problems getting it right where you want it. Take a look at how successful this is. We have red, white, and blue paint, which we are going to splatter on a piece of black poster board for fireworks. Fabulous. Thwack it again. Wonderful. Thwack it, okay. Up over here. Fantastic. So we are in a higher place, dropping one of those balls. Now wasn't that gorgeous? This is Susan Evans from SusanEvans.org. Happy 4th of July.